hundreds of leaders and activists of all European Awami League staged demonstration holding Dr. Yunus responsible for plunging the country into further chaos, including inaction to stop ongoing killing spree of party leaders and activists, impunity for attackers, failure to ensure law and order, and uphold rule of law. They also protested at failure of the government to stop the spate of attack on minority communities across the country, forced resignation of academics, emergence of mob rule in all walks of lives, and lack of any concrete step from the regime to bring perpetrators to book. Frustrated at the silence of Dr. Yunus at the targeted attack against Awami League leaders and activists across the country, by BNP Jamaat caters for over three weeks, they equated the inaction of Yunus to a farce with pledge to ensure fairness in trial process and reform judiciary. Every day since August 5th, Awami League leaders are falling prey to violence orchestrated by BNP Jamaat combined across the country. Our party leaders are getting slaughtered, their residences are attacked and looted, families were subjected to physical assault, and the vicious cycle is getting intensified only as there is no respite," added Nasrul Islam, president of all European Awami League. While Yunus claims to build inclusive society and reform the nation, then how can he L maintain silence against these attacks and even left out Awami League from dialogues, he questioned. They also said the ongoing purge in key state organs, including judiciary, is carried out violating the UN call for carrying out reforms based on a vetting process. They were holding banners reading World Must Speak Up to End Mob Violence by BNP Jamaat Against People of Bangladesh. And posters include We Want Fair Trial of Every Death Related to Violence Among Others expressing concern over prospect of fair trail to all the deaths under the regime, they appealed to global powers to stop the attacks on detainees on court premises, detention of party leaders, and politicization of judiciary end the rule of mob violence, and stop ongoing massacre of the people from different walks of lives vocal against BNP Jamaat regime. Expressing condolences at the loss of lives law during the movement, they also demanded fair trials into the every single death from the start of the movement, but in an impartial manner, not for a witch hunt. Pointing out filing of at least 269 cases in the aftermath of August 5th, targeting Awami League leaders and activists, they branded the plot as move to imprison party leaders and a clear marker of judicial harassment to quell the party. They staged the protest in front of the European Union headquarters at Brussels in participation of President of All European Awami League N, Nasrul Islam, and General Secretary Mujibur Rahman, while activists and leaders from different countries from EU also took part at the protest. Holding Dr. Yunus responsible for the purge in administration, forced removal of teachers and weaponization of judiciary, they told them, Pointing out the ongoing spree of forced removal of officials from key government offices, they added these malpractices, unless stopped, would ruin integrity of institutions and break down law and order. They gathered in front of the headquarters at Brussels and staged the protest as part of shoring up global support against ongoing malpractices.